Airbud was a popular movie, but what happened to the dog that starred in it? Let's see the whole story. Buddy was estimated to be born March 23, 1988. Kevin DeChico found him in the following location, June Lake, California. Buddy was about one year old. Kevin DeChico brought him home and adopted him and taught him many tricks. Such as basketball, soccer, baseball, hockey, and football. In 1992, he made his first television appearance in America's Funniest Home Videos. In 1994, he on the Dave Letterman Show with his owner. In 1995, he starred in the popular sitcom Full House. Alright, now you look like a real athlete. Uh, why don't we work on some passing? Uh, okay, some passing. Good. I'm gonna pass you the ball. Thank you. Come it. Over here, boy. Okay, stay. Stay. Back up. Sit. Good boy. Okay, come it. This isn't as hard as Jesse makes it look. Okay, all you have to do is just get ready, aim, and shoot. June 2nd, 1995, he starred in his first movie, Fluke. While Fluke was a popular movie, it had a budget of $15 million and only made oh, under three. In 1997, he starred in his most popular movie yet, Air Bud. Air Bud became one of the most popular movies of the year. It had a budget of $3 million and made over $27 million. Buddy's fame began to grow. Everyone knew him, although sadly, not everyone can have a happy ending. Six months after the film, Buddy got diagnosed with cancer. Due to cancer, his leg had to be removed. February 10th, 1998, we lost Buddy to cancer. Airbud Golden Receiver was made in his memory. Buddy's ashes were buried in an undisclosed area by his owner. In August 2012, Kevin wrote a book about Buddy, about his life.